be careful. Look how like close they are to the water bed. They want you to so if you're a group, you're gonna be standing right here. And they it seems like they just want two people. So I guess she's very good. People live like this for real. It's the morning time. Uh, I don't know if these videos, these clips are gonna be in order. I'm recording them all in different orders, but uh, I'm gonna see how I can make this video make sense. But it is early morning. I'm at a really nice resort here in Santa Marta, and I thought I'd share it with you. There's a bunch of different restaurants and everything. The reason why I wanna share this with you is because we're actually going through the whole issue with 2020, and the country of Colombia is opening up, and some of you guys are planning on traveling here. So I wanna record the experience of what you are going to encounter when you come here, as in terms of biosecurity. In order for any of these businesses to open up, they have to come up with new procedures on how they can accommodate their guests. So that's what's gonna be, I'm gonna be showing you. And I thought I'd show it to you at a, a different higher level. I'm actually here with a guest. Let me go get my breakfast. One else, one else. All right, so I have breakfast, and I guess they had a little special thing when I um, checked in, and the, the breakfast was basically included. It's not everything included. You pay more for a complimentary breakfast, but so I get like unlimited buffet uh, food, whatever. It's not a place where you stand up and get it. You have to order it, and they bring it to you, but you can get as much as you want, and it's all included. Frappuccino. Un frappuccino. And it's como es? Muy bueno? Very good. Very good, okay. Hubiésemos tomado una mesa más amplia. O sea, es entradas, algo. No, buffet. Buffet. Todo general. Also, this is all general. This is all going to come to you generally. Got the guy coming with the. This is nothing we ordered, this is just comes along with it. Okay. Oh, mucho. Mucha comida. Yo come todo eso. Es un arriba. Arriba. Yes. Es un. Ah, el. Morcilla. Morcilla. Es un con. Es sangre. No. Sangre de puerco. No, no, no. No, no. So she does it. She says it's not with um, blood, made with blood, pork, blah, 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 but she's like, no. What I need to try first. This, this. ¿Cuál? Tú me dices comer algo. ¿Qué quieres probar primero? Yo digo esto. Fruta primero. I don't like fruit, but we'll try fruit. <laughs> it's good, baby. Perfect. Hey guys, this is nothing what we ordered. This audit automatically comes with the buffet and it's a trick to get you yena <laughs> so you can't eat the other food you eat little of the other food that is worth son. all of this stuff is like really cheap to eat to make so to, in order for them to save they'll give you all this to fill you up and then they'll give you the real deal so i'm gonna just eat maybe the queso y jamón only mano yeah and then it's probably not the proper way and the vibe. <laughs> I'm sorry. All right, guys. So we got um some food here. So this is a roasted booty fryer. You remember when I went to Soledad, I ate some booty fryer. So that's this chopped up rice and um, a type of uh, meat they make in Soledad, known as uh, Soledad Colombia. Okay. So. This is my other meal. So that's um, eggs mixed with um, some ham. I don't I guess I don't know say. So they mixed it, put some cheese up in there. Okay, like so. And so this is what I ordered. It's a lot. Oh, and I forgot, you know me. Hey, baby, sorry. No, I didn't, I didn't. So, I, um, no tiene mayonesa, algo así. You know I gotta get a mayonnaise, so I got some little home uh, style fries right here, and yeah, this is it. Off of the hundred bucks, guys. This all came in the the deal. 
All right, guys. So uh, I'm gonna try some of this eggs right here. Baby. Shout out to my camera girl. Okay. Okay. Cook really good. You know, sometimes you'll have buffet eggs and not they're not seasoned. It's bland. They make that so they don't. If someone wants to season it, it it's really good, nice season. And let me try the puti para. I wish they gave me a little spoon though. They gave me a fork. Mm. Really good. <laughs> We're gonna be seeing um, the, the big suite. Trying to see if they'll um, budge on giving your boy YouTuber extra discount, but I doubt it. Oh. Wow, guys. So, this is a huge situation right here. Wow. A lot of room. So, Obviously your bed, your little seating area, your work area. This would be perfect for me. I can work here and put the laptop here. Um, if you're reading something light. And what's this? Is a balcony? Yes, this is a balcony. All right, so here we go. Wow. So you really get a good look at the place from here. This room was going for around 300. So it's a very expensive room. I was trying to get it for the three dollars. All right. And they weren't trying to give it to me for the three dollars. But this is what you get, man. Very nice situation here. You get to see the ocean breeze. Huge um entry and plus you get to um enjoy the nice little um sun breeze it's my cell phone right there and you can get a little tan on right here your jacuzzi oh this would be the reason why i come out here okay let me see if this thing opens probably doesn't let's go back through the other door and explore some more but yeah and you know the higher you go is probably the more expensive it can be into like the ninth floor which we're on the ninth floor ah uh, this one's a nice so this is like a residential place so they got a pool here and they got a pool on the top that's set up clean okay this huge television man <laughs> no joke and then you're wondering how this looks yeah that's dope but you can't be here for one day you're not gonna enjoy it not gonna be enough and then excuse me cell phone and then you got this nice little bathroom here and 
you get right out to the terrace area, which is even though. So you can really be taking a shower and then come out here, enjoy the situation. But yeah, wanted to show you, not bad. I just wanted to show this place right here. So you got a couple restaurants here, one downstairs and one upstairs. Upstairs is where I had the breakfast, but this is directly downstairs. And it's supposed to give you a different type of vibe. You can order whatever you want, but they, like each place has their specialties they can cook for you. So that's cool. There are hotels like this that are a little bit lower in quality, but offer you same views, a different type of pool, different type of service and you can get it for half the price around 60,000 well excuse me uh, instead of 100 bucks you'll be paying around 50 bucks so it's up to you depending i just wanted to go to see what you can get for 100 bucks or 300 bucks Gatorade here things here yeah like the drinks here is ex kind of expensive and they don't allow you to bring alcohol but well, you can't order alcohol to the pool, but you can bring it in like some other type of container. So that's what you can do if you're trying to like enjoy your pool time. Soon all of these regulations will be tweaked to back where they are. I think the only thing people need to be concerned about is distance, keeping your distance and wearing your mask when you can at the appropriate places. Pool area is pretty much shot. You know what I mean? Poor is pretty much shot. They might as well just serve you alcohol there and you know keep it going. But uh, to each his own, things will be changing soon. Alright guys, so they're telling me I could just grab what I need and then just pay over there. So front desk, let's do it. Okay. Huh? Alrighty? Yeah, wrap it up. Okay. Do you want to get one more night? Yeah. And a memo. Yeah, because you don't give me the, the free. Okay, sir. So, okay, we need them and you can pay later or Mañana. I, I stand it for tomorrow. I check out tomorrow, okay? Okay. No problem? Yeah? Okay. <laughs> There's more than one elevator here. We'll take the other one. The other one's not as busy as the other one. Yeah, I do hear like I'm other Americans here, so I don't, I don't think they just got here. I think they've been here. Got people balling up in here, man. I tell you, man. People be thinking, you know. They got, uh, if anything else, they got pretty much something for anybody. If you want this type of energy, they got it. They got that little expensive type she she energy, they got it. Whatever you want, they got it. Guys, I'm here with my drone and I'm trying to lift this thing up. And this is the first thing I've ever encountered. But then I just realized it totally makes sense. It's actually an airport next door. It's telling me unauthorized flying zone area. Because it's literally an airport. You don't hear it but it's like an airport like maybe it's not that far away like from my balcony i can see the the planes there you look over there you can actually see the airport right there you can i don't know if you can see it it's like a white tower that's uh i forgot the name of the the control center right there so and they have a small strip there but they have like decent sized planes over there like a 727 or one of the small ones one of the small aircraft uh passenger planes right there yeah like a, a small boeing over there not bad not bad but that's the reason why i can't lift my drone up so we're gonna go further back down this way i like that though i wonder how they take off they take off that way or because i saw the plane it was coming up this way and then it turned around <laughs> i used to deal with um jets private jets a different lifestyle and so I used to be able to make a plane turn around, flip, and do like gymnastic moves just by using my hand, uh, hand signals. And, and you gotta be careful. Look how like close they are to the water, man. There's like little to no, like there's little to no um, space there. 
they gotta like if anything they would have to stop the, you can't even see it it's like a white strip right there they would have to stop there if they're gonna do any turns because if anything if they get too close that wing will go over the fence and, and it looks like there's cars that can drive around there but it was pretty cool pretty cool though anyways you get to see uh where i'm staying here all right not bad guys you will not believe we got this place Shout out to the staff and they showed us love. Hold on, I'm gonna put this on the mute right quick. I'm coming. But you making sure we good, brother. All right, so I put it on mute. And so they got us the place we're gonna, for, they didn't give it to us free, but they gave it to us for 50 bucks more. And I was like, uh, I will pay that 50 bucks more. They, you know, for what they wanted. Hola y me dicen que soy un bombón. We were supposed to go downstairs to the pool and she said why go to a pool when you got the jacuzzi, right? So <laughs> No, no necesito el, el piscina. No, no necesito piscina, only jacuzzi. I'm bueno, I'm bueno. <laughs> Como es tu experiencia? My okay. experience is it's very good. <laughs> yeah. Oh, where? ¿Qué es eso? Uh, no, no, allá abajo pensé que era un patón. <laughs> <laughs> She's calling me. Okay, okay. All right, guys, so we were supposed to get in the pool. Oh, it looks so awesome, but it's quiet right now. We were supposed to go in the pool, but she was like, no, jacuzzi. And so we're going to do that. And um, But we don't know how it works. ¿Cómo sabía? ¿Tú no sabes? ¿Tú sabes cómo es? ¿Sipe? Sí, sí sirve. So figure out, let's figure out how it works. Oh, I think this is what no, I work here. No, no. Okay, no, no. We'll let her do it and figure it out. When I do these videos, it's to share the moments and experience with you guys. So I hope so. you understand that. Yeah, I already know how y'all thinking everything. <laughs> She's my home girl, okay? All right, so. More, then I can abre el agua primero. Yeah, yeah, yeah. No, 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 no. Okay, no, well, no. okay, we'll wait. Okay. We'll let her figure it out then. <laughs> yeah, yeah, I'm not gonna believe. I'm sleeping right here. Right? Believe it or not, all right. Like even in the other room, you, I didn't show you the other room, but the other room we had like two beds, right? And this is just a friend, and I'm glad she's here because. It helps my channel. Wow. ¿Cómo te te gusta ese cuarto? Eh, este se me gusta mucho porque es muy amplia, tiene un buen jacuzzi, tiene doble entrada. She loves it's it. Very good. It's and beautiful. All right. There's always deals online when it comes to staying in rooms here. Now, if you look, this is like a residential apparently, but I I bet you there's some Airbnbs here, and throughout this whole strip, there's Airbnbs. Promise you, man. So Airbnb is going to be another route that you should always consider doing if you're coming to um, Colombia. See, but you can find yourself some good deals. But like, if you want to stay like close to where all the action is, they already know this. They're going to charge you whatever the price is. But if you rather stay a little further away, get something real good for cheaper and then save. You're going to save just a little bit enough with the taxis, then it's fine. Then you, you can do that route. Because where I was, where I saw in Cartagena, it was not where the tourist area was. It was more hoodish, but it was front, like beachfront property and modernized um, buildings. So you're gonna find stuff like that. All right. Anyways, let me. Um, I'll be back. All right, yo. So guys, I've been talking to my people on IG. I don't follow me, man. Y'all be missing out, man. Check out my people on IG, man. Yeah, we be out here, man. It's like, what time is it, guys? It's like, let me look. It's 4, 4, uh, 21 in the morning, guys. Yeah, man, yeah, we be really out here, man. Y'all be sleep. All right, we be really out here, man. All right, guys. Uh, uh, I'm gonna holler at you guys later, man. We, uh, I'm gonna continue to vlog this. So I'm gonna go in the water, man. Enjoy. All right. Peace, man. Thanks for showing up, man. Appreciate it, man. Love, love, love. My friend is sleeping. And I said, I am not going to be here and not use the jacuzzi. All right. Let me give you the vibes. You can't hear it now. But maybe you can, the waves that are coming from the ocean, right? 
beautiful waves are coming from the you can hear the noises uh, from the wave and then right now everything's kind of dark obviously right but uh let's get in this jacuzzi man i have a drink right here and uh nice warm feels good man I feel feels also bad people live like this for real <laughs> people live like this for real guys so, what am I drinking we got this I, I just purchased this right here but what we did was I'm gonna turn the jets off so y'all can hear me a little bit better hold on now y'all can hear me like hey we could hear you brother all right so this is like a drink they have here at the hotel I got this it's like seven dollars but it's kind of light so i was like nah let me just buy one of these this is like 10 bucks right less than 10 bucks like around about eight eight dollars for this bottle right here it's a smirnoff bottle and so basically i just place it put it in there to get it give it a little extra it works so oh. <laughs> good man all right guys tomorrow i'll talk about the experiences of being in this hotel and what you should expect when traveling um to a hotel like this we'll, yeah we'll be back so i want to show you how people how the food is being brought here so let's check it out welcome oh, stars Okay. All right, guys. So I want to show you this. This comes in here. This is to um, sign things, but also comes with alcohol. So I'm going to sign for the room service they just gave us here. And then put this in there. And then I'll get the hand side of right here. See? Okay. You're gonna get. I get this. See? But nosotros. All right. And then, so they're making sure their staff comes with gloves. He got gloves. He's wearing a mask as well. So just to help people feel safe with when it comes to it. Bio security. Bueno, gracias. Okay. All right. All right, guys. So I'm back in the lobby, and I just wanted to show you how they have things set up. So when guests show up, you're gonna have like dots and markers to stand on they want you so if you're a group you're going to be standing right here and they it seems like they just want two people more as more so if you're like in a group and y'all checking in two people for a group they'll make sense everybody standing in if you're going to be in the same room but you have to see how they have things set up here and they're not pretty much aligned so it's different so now look see and so that's how they have things one of the ways they have the bios um, safety um, procedures and for you guys you guys are used to this you know what I mean like having this okay so they want you I guess they might want you to have that when you're coming in I think the Colombia government is gonna have you um, download this app so you can have it on your phone it's less traffic now because people are slowly dwindling in but give this place a couple uh weeks and it'll be back into booming state we're gonna have a whole bunch of people coming in families and just coming in here and not only this place but places that you probably might consider going to all right guys so now i'm gonna give you a little tour of the place a little bit better there's some people in the pool so i gotta be careful i'm filming uh, but uh pretty much this is like a little lounge area people like to be outside <laughs> okay and this is a pool area right here now 
This is another building. This is not the hotel. It is connected to the building, but it's like separate. It's like a private uh, situation over here. So it's like Marriott probably has their residential places here, which is super dope. They have a decent sized pool. But I like this one right here. And you move up here. Yeah, get a cool look. Everything is set up clean. All right. Cabanas. Everything's not normal here. Obviously, if you're coming to the pool, guys, you're not gonna be wearing a face mask in the water. It's just stupid. So, you know what I mean? It's no reason for that, but water is amazing here, guys. Look, got a nice little backdrop right here. You can see the mountains and everything. Pretty cool, it's pretty dope. Water is looking amazing, the way it's simmering right here. Um, yeah, guys, love this place. Important thing to note, when you come out here, please look at the policies of the the city you're coming to. Each city is run differently. And so if it's like a beach con um, a city and you're trying to go to the beach, just find out if they have particular rules on the beach. Cause yesterday I came here and the beaches were closed. So this is one of the reasons why I'm still here because I'm planning on going to one of the popular beaches here. But uh, today their beaches are open and they are open for a particular time frame and then you're gonna have to, they stop it for a particular time frame, then you can use it. Let me ask, Señor, uh, ¿a qué tiempo el, el, el playa está abierto? Eh, cinco de la tarde. ¿Ahora? ¿Hasta las cinco? Hasta las cinco de la tarde, sí, señor. Oh, ok, ¿en la mañana o no, o no? La mañana, desde las nueve de la mañana hasta las cinco de la tarde. Oh, so nine to five o'clock, you can use the beach. All right, bueno. Cool beach. And uh, matter of fact, as you can see, I'm not going to show you too much, but they have the cabanas like spread out between all the situations giving people enough space to uh do what they need to do all right and so this is a privately set up beach when you go to the public beaches it's gonna be i think they're gonna have it enforced in a similar way but it might be a little bit hectic too i say this guys if you're gonna come here this come here with some a lot of patience because the thing about it is they're they're trying to fix things up now and you know they're gonna go through some kinks ironing out things so sometimes you're gonna be like yo you're too close to me or somebody might be in your face and you might not like that yeah let me move down here show you a little bit more of that oh yeah this place is decent man decent place no complaints Okay, going up. All right. Beautiful beach right here. Lovely. Lovely. I, I'm in love with this place. Really cool. All right. And then this leads into an indoor restaurant eating area. You can see, you can see these dots everywhere. Like I said right now, Everything set up in a way that's going to promote biosafety, security, but eventually this place is going to get packed. And then that's going to be their biggest test to see whether or not they can handle that type of situation. Now, if you want to use other facilities like the gyms they have set up here, you can do it. But uh, you gotta like reserve the time and everything and then you can only be in the gym for a set time. Here, it's one hour. So, it's, it's, it's a stat. Also guys, I wanna highlight this, right? They put stickers that lead up to the door right here to let you know that the place has been clean, all right? So, that's how you know the place is clean. They'll put the sticker here and the door hasn't been opened. <laughs> This place is amazing guys, I'm gonna miss it. I really had a great time here guys. If you are coming to Santa Marta, make sure you come over here and let them know that I sent you. All right, you, will, you won't regret it. The staffing is um, 
the staffing here is really good they are very patient with you and they are willing to work with you if they can't help you out they'll try to figure out a way to make things work out and which i really enjoy uh, and not for nothing this place is amazing the pool amazing if you can get a room with a jacuzzi ah uh, you won't regret it especially with that beautiful sea air we're close to an airport but you're not going to hear the planes okay <laughs> I, I saw only one plane take off since then i don't know if it's going to the airport's going to get busy but it doesn't it doesn't bother you because the windows of the place are really soundproof oh man that backdrop is just everything anyways guys thanks for watching on the way i don't know what video is coming next but continue to watch all right <laughs> oh you here are you from santa marta no i'm from venezuela oh you venezuelan woman i don't know i know beautiful venezuelan women <laughs> yeah <laughs> Okay. <laughs> <laughs> All right, guys, we'll talk. Ooh.